Hi, I thought you might be ready for another update from the campaign trail, so here we go. In case you haven't heard, I'm Amanda Curtis, and I'm running for the United States Senate. And this week, we've been to Bozeman and Billings to roll out our plan for reducing student loan debt. And I've gotten to meet with great groups from each of these different communities. I met with veterans in Billings, and with a group of students in Bozeman, and with a group of labor leaders in Helena. And at all of these places, folks are so frustrated um, with Congressman Daines hiding behind his four-word jobs plan. And they want to know um, what our answer to that is. And of course, the answer is an actual jobs plan that really helps Montana businesses and their families. And ours includes closing corporate tax loopholes. Those tax loopholes that help millionaires like Congressman Daines and his billionaire friends like the Koch brothers who are working so hard to get this man, uh, to try to get this guy elected. The plan also includes helping Montana businesses succeed and compete on a global market. And you know, when I was first asked to step up and accept this nomination, in the paper I said what was in my heart, which is who wouldn't want to run against Steve Daines? And I really meant it then, and it continues to be the joy of this campaign that I get to go and be the voice for all of us who have been saying the same things over the last couple of years about how wrong Congressman Daines is for Montana. Just as an example, yesterday on the walking mall, I got to give a speech to a big group of people. I got to end that speech with, I won't stop until we truly have achieved equal pay for equal work, because we all know that economic growth comes from empowering everyone in the middle class, not from giving handouts to the men at the top. That was pretty fun. Thanks, and I'll see you soon.